This video is going to be unscripted, and I do recommend you watch to the end, even if it's long and tedious for you. When I'm sorry, I didn't mean that. I love you. Anyways, today I'm going to be talking about the state of YouTube. I should mention really quickly that I'm really thankful and appreciative of your support on my Combat Wombat animation. I didn't think I'd actually get that much support, and I probably never will again, but hey, it means a lot to me, so thank you while I can. Anyways, I want to talk about the state of YouTube and what I'm going to do regarding my channel. Uh, this is... It's kind of hard to come to terms with the fact that YouTube is changing. Now, I don't think people are, are... I don't think commentary channels are actually going to be banned. In fact, I highly doubt it, thankfully, because YouTube would lose a lot of money in that case, and I think they know that. But the fact that they're demonetizing people who make commentary videos about other creators, and they're creating a policy that prevents such things, is kind of... It's kind of dumb. Now, YouTube, if you or any of your staff are watching this, which I highly doubt, but hey, let's go with, let's just say any of you are, at least one, just hear me out. I don't want my channel to be banned. I don't think Combat Wombat should be banned. I don't think Penguin Zero or Critical should be banned. I don't think any commentary channel should be banned. Because at the end of the day, commentary channels, they aren't, the purpose isn't to harass people. It's to show the community that, hey, this is wrong, or hey, that here's something I learned, or something like that. It really, any, it could be about anything. It could be about a game, it could be about a person, it could be about an event, it could be something good, bad, weird, whatever. But we're, our purpose isn't to try and get our viewers to go and harass other people. If there is a commentary channel like that, go ahead and go after them. But that's not my purpose. My purpose is to show my viewers, hey, here's something I learned, or hey, this is wrong. Now, when I make a commentary video about another creator, it's to show the community, hey, you should not be doing this. This is, this is wrong. And it's to attempt to deter them from doing something like that so we can make the community a better place. Because making commu YouTube's community better is one of my priorities. Knowing that YouTube can, is very capable of having a great community full of great people and, uh, you know, good connections. And it means a lot to me. And I want to be able to share my experiences with you guys. I want to be able to share my story. I want to be able to talk to you guys about things. I'm, I, I just want to get my uh, voice out there when I'm bored. I want to be able to talk about video games. I want to be able to talk about, uh, you know, all kinds of stuff. Now, I, I don't... The creator-on-creator creator harassment policy is a little weird. Because I did see a tweet. Now, I remember Wombat was talking about being worried about his channel getting terminated. Now, thankfully, he shouldn't have to worry about that because if you look into the tweet that uh, YouTube replied with uh, to Keemstar's tweet about YouTube uh, banning people for uh, talking about other creators, uh, they actually said this isn't true and that they're talking about... They, they never said anything about banning people, but they did mention demonetization. Now... You can call me crazy for this opinion, but it's better than being terminated. Because at the end of the day, you still have your channel. You still have your viewer base. You still have all your hard work. You know, it's not gone. Uh, I've been making commentary videos for quite a long time now, obviously. And I'm not going to stop. Because that's what I enjoy doing. I do not, I do not encourage you guys going to the people that I make videos about and harassing them. Because I don't want to be on the receiving end of the consequences for those actions. Because I'm not the one condoning it. I don't condone it. Uh, now, there are... There is a little bit of a technicality. Now, if you think about the, like, the guy who was doxing me, I'm not going to name him simply for the sake of this video and what I've been saying just so I can prove my point. I don't want to be an absolute hypocrite in one video. Uh, I wouldn't recommend going and harassing him, but... If he starts doxing me again, I would recommend reporting him. I wouldn't recommend going to his channel and saying, hey, he doesn't even upload, okay? But it, I wouldn't recommend harassing him regardless. I'd just say, report him and be done with it. Don't reply to him in the comments. Uh, just report the comment, downvote it, and then be done. Because at the end of the day, again, I don't want to be on the receiving end of the consequences for harassing somebody because you felt that it was the right thing to do. I, I just don't want to be in trouble for something you guys chose to do. I'm not trying to talk down on you guys. I'm not trying to be rude. I'm just, I'm just saying I don't want my channel to be ripped away from me because some people in the comments made poor choices, uh, for lack of a better word. Now, again, do I think YouTube's going to ban uh, commentary channels? I highly doubt it, okay? I just want to say... 
I'm I'm sorry for this video being a little different. I'm sorry if I got a little too deep for you guys. Uh, I, I completely understand. But when I make commentary videos, just remember, I'm not doing it to harass people. Uh, if I get genuinely angry, I have a good reason to, but I'm still not going to tell you to go and harass them. Like, Alinity, uh, if you remember Alinity's... Uh, now, I did, I did, uh, link her stream once on Discord, I will admit, uh, because, you know, I, I felt like being a troll. But, I'm not going to recommend doing that. Now, when I get angry, when I actually get angry, I have a reason to. Like, with Alinity, as I was saying... You know, she had things like, uh, throwing her cat, uh, abusing animals in general, actually, and then Jay's station with exploiting the deaths of celebrities for his own monetary gain. That's pretty scummy, if you ask me. Uh, and thankfully, and if you think about it, YouTube, or really anybody watching this, and hopefully YouTube sees this as well, commentary channels are beneficial because, you know, and criticism videos, uh, too, because Jay, got, when Jay made that video about Etika, he got crazy amounts of criticism. Like, to put it in Wombat's words, he got criticized to hell and back. And ever since then, you know, he hasn't made another video uh, like that. You know, there was a death of a Disney celebrity. Very unfortunate, by the way, because he was only 20. And I feel really bad because I remember seeing that guy on a show when I was growing up. But, and, you know, just seeing that really broke my heart. But uh, thankfully, J Station has not made another video like that since. So I'm starting to get a little more trustworthy at J Station. My trust is beginning to show a little more. But uh, that's because of criticism. Because at the end of the day, nobody was telling people to harass him. But they were telling people, this is wrong. This needs to stop. And it stopped. So, criticism is beneficial. Just remember that. YouTube, I don't care if my videos are demonetized. I, I really can't monetize them right now anyways. And I doubt I'm going to get any kind of support to be able to monetize them in the near future. But, I, I want to thank you for letting me have my channel back. It means a ton. I know I'm disrespectful to you sometimes. I know I get angry. But, it's because I love YouTube and I want it to be better is it better than twitch still yes call me crazy for thinking that but at least they don't allow animal abuse to go by without a second thought uh, y you know and they don't ban men uh, to show their favoritism of women women but uh I just Susan if Susan is watching this even <clears throat> I'll probably tweet this video at them at some point. I don't hate your website. I just want you to improve. Because at the end of the day, that's what everybody wants. I want to be able to upload my uh, commentary videos. That's what I love doing. I want to make money doing this. It's my dream. I don't want to see my dream get ripped away from me. Uh, you do need to fix my channel sign in anyways, like I said. Because uh, when I try to sign in directly, it says I'm, un uh, I'm suspended. But my channel is unsuspended. So I don't know what's going on with that. Because uh, I know I got unsuspended after I went through a long and tedious process of showing you proof that I was hacked. So, you know, you gave it back. And thank you for that, by the way. But it, it means a lot. But uh, all, all I can say any, uh, for the to close this video off, I want to thank you guys for your support. Criticism videos are not hate. If somebody's telling them to go and hate this person or find their house and beat them up, that's, that's creator on creator harassment. But if it's just, hey, this person did something wrong and we need to do something to stop it, then, or, or we need to make sure YouTube sees this and fixes it, that's not harassment. I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Donate to my Patreon. That's a new link. The link will be in the description. I doubt anybody will do that, but it's there anyways. Uh, it comes with uh, benefits such as being in future videos, being able to write scripts if you're, uh, you know, there's three tiers. Uh, and in each tier, you get shouted out at the end of a video. Now, unlike a lot of YouTubers, my plan is to actually read out every name. So, there's a benefit, I guess. You get a special Discord role. You get to talk with me personally, even though I'm really in a, a lot of, um, I'm in chat a lot of the time. Uh, but, I mean, you, you do get to talk with me personally, I guess. And uh, I also, uh, follow me on Twitter. Join my Discord server. I might have already, I don't think I already said that. 
uh, my Discord server is full of a lot of really cool peeps, uh, you know, pretty cool, pretty cool dudes, um, and, uh, YouTube, thank you for letting me keep my channel, it, it means the world to me, and I really hope I do continue getting as much love and support as I did on the last video, I know that, again, I know that video wasn't about me, but it's still, it's still blew my mind to see that much support on a single video. I love you guys. Mwah. No homo. Uh, I'll talk to you in the next video. My, uh, now, I should also say, I'm, I'm sorry, one last thing before you go. My 90s FPS roundup is not cancelled, if you were wondering. I will be getting it out later. Uh, it's going to take a little bit because I don't have all my footage yet because I've been busy playing Doom 64 for the first time, which I'm really enjoying, so I'm probably going to make a video on that first. On top of that, I've got other things I've been working on, so... Uh, I've got a music remake in the works, actually. Uh, one of the soundtracks from Duke Nukem 3D, which I think you guys might like. Uh, will I do more animations? Probably. Probably. Uh, not very common, but it's likely I'll do some more in the future. I'm not really sure when, though. Uh, but, yeah, got a lot of projects in the works. My next video is Doom is going to be called Doom 64 is a Little Strange. And uh, here's a uh, sneak peek at the thumbnail, uh, which I think, I think if you compare this Kako Demon to the one in the original Doom, I think you'll see where this Doom 64 is a Little Strange is coming from. Now, don't get me wrong, I love Doom 64. It's, it's so awesome. And um, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. I love you all.